post a wall a couple times. When you're backing up, you look for a clear path before you head on your way. You can see your little camera down there. But sometimes you just can't see what's behind you. My wife has an older Honda. My youngest grandson was playing with his bicycle and left it right behind my wife's car. And my wife proceeded to back out because she didn't have a backup camera, couldn't see the, the bike and ran it right over. It's a scene that plays out all too often for many people. But tragically, it's not only bikes that are left behind the car. The National Highway Traffic Safety administration estimates there are 210 deaths and 15,000 injuries every year just from back over crashes. But as of May 2018, all passenger cars must have backup cameras. It's something most car companies have already started rolling out. The idea behind it is basically to see what's directly behind your car to make sure there are no pets or bicycles or people. It's cars like this Toyota RAV4 that give you a view you might not immediately see through your rear window. The NHTSA estimates that the rule will save 69 lives a year, and people who do use the technology say it's something that could help help keep their families safe. Because it provides a, a level of safety when you're backing up that you're not going to run over anything that might be in the driveway or just if there's cars behind you. Honda salesmen say the feature only upped the price of cars about $150. But dollars and cents can't measure the value of keeping people safe. More and more people are coming in and asking for it. It's a, it's a very, very good safety feature. For covering the news in Rhinelander, Mary O'Connell, Newswatch 12. Right behind your vehicle. This is a wide